softball today on Flow Sports. As Jay's video brings you all the action of this final game of a three-game set between the Yukon Huskies and the Creighton Blue Jays. for UConn. Talk about Natalia Pacino being the workhorse for the Blue Jays. It is Jenkins that is the workhorse for UConn. And she gives up a 2-0 single to Kayla Nielsen. And the Blue Jays are in business here in the bottom half of the first inning. Can't say enough about Kaylee Wilson and what she's done over her career here at Creighton. The 1-1 ripped to right center, coming on quickly and keeping Nielsen at second base is Lexi Hastings. She was there in an instant. And that kept Nielsen from turning and chugging to third. For the Huskies, it's Hope Jenkins, the pitcher. And she blasts that one deep left center, carrying, and it is gone. Make it 3-0 as Hope Jenkins goes deep to left center for run number three. Yeah, Hope Jenkins, incredible what she's able to do, not only in the circle, but on the batter's box as well. Ask Coach Wood just about the leaders on this team. First name she said was Madeline Baveda and how she stepped up as a leader for the squad and being one of the veteran players on the team. Flair under right center, that'll get in for a base hit. As the center fielder, Asia James, will come over and grab it on a bounce. So a one-out single for the Blue Jays so far on the scoreboard. And the pitch. There's a little flare in the left. That's a base hit. It gets down, will continue to roll. Over to get it, Azopra Scotto. She'll get it in before anybody can think about third, but it keeps the inning alive for Kayla Nielsen. Two away, and the fresh. Got to make sure those are established before the game gets underway. The 2-1, there's a drive to deep center field for Nielsen, carrying, and it is gone. We've got a tie ball game here in the second in Omaha. This is exactly what Creighton had been missing, getting those runners off base and making sure they come home. Kayla Nielsen delivering. Fifth home run of the season for Kayla Nielsen, and there's a no doubter. We had one in the top of the inning off the bat of the pitcher. This time, Kayla Nielsen, the lefty. Look at the ride she gives it. Big stroke to right center field over the top part of the wall. And frame it. And Dalton in front of her come in to score, and it's all knotted up at three. Big situation here. Two outs, bases loaded. Here's the 2 2. Swing and a miss. Hope Jenkins strikes out. A big piece of pitching by Natalia Pacino as the Huskies leave the bases loaded. Huge strikeout right there for Natalia. Big spot here for the Huskies to extend this one-run lead. The one-two. Big swing and a miss. Excuse me, two-run lead. Exactly what Pacino needed on the punch out. And that's number 100 for Natalia Pacino, the freshman. <laughs> hit on a line over to right field and Lexi Hastings collects it. Kaylee Wilson character. That one's off the glove of Savannah Ring. Yeah, sharply hit ball by Gappa and Ring trying to get that on the backhand. It just rolled up her arm and into the outfield. So the Jays have got a chance here with two away and two on. And that'll be Emma Rosanke that steps in. Jays would love to cut into it right here. Live life like a 3-1 pitch, right? That one's hit towards left field and will get down, so bases loaded. Emma Rosanke delivering with the single. Nice piece of hitting by Emma. Just going the other way, and Kaylee Wilson holding up at third. There and seeing if they'll take that first pitch, and Naki delivers a perfect one down the middle. There's another deep ball hit to right field. This time it's gone again. Two three-run bombs for Kayla Nielsen. And she has put the Blue Jays within four here in Omaha.
Well, the rally caps work, Jake. How about those visors flipped upside down? Sixth home run of the year for Nielsen. I tell you what, don't even let her bat unless there's runners on base. My goodness, a pair of three-run homers for Kayla Nielsen. This time, she saw the first pitch go by, does not let the second pitch go by, and just to the right field side of where the first homer went out. And now Lily West will step in, and find some green. And right down the pipe, Dalton turning. Thought maybe it was inside, but instead it's a called strikeout. And that does it. Four straight series sweep for the Yukon Huskies. They moved to 31 and 11 on the season and 18 and 3.